This is one of the more unusual vocabulary questions, these most nearly means questions. Uh, sometimes we get these first, sometimes we get these last. Uh, it doesn't matter. Basically, remember the rules of the game here is that we are not, uh, we are given the word in the blank, basically, because it's a literature or poem or something like that. Uh, and so we need to just define it based on the context. Now, normally, we should be very wary of uh, answer choices that are the literal definition of the word. So what's the literal definition of the word trace? Well, uh, it's one of those words that has lots of literal definitions. I would kind of be drawn to something like sketch, uh, right? Trace something out with a pen. But um, I think this is an easy module question. So uh, yeah, it's not going to be so bad. Let's take a look. At supper time, at supper time Foxfoot uh, uh, would allow no fire to be built, no landing to be made, no trace of their passing to be left. So you leave a trace, you leave evidence of something. So it, it's definitely A. Uh, they ate canned meat and marmalade, drank again in the stream, and pushed on until just at dark they reached the edge of the long, stale lake with shores of gravity and dense fur forest. So I don't think the rest of it gives me anything. Um, you could just take the answer choices and, and plug them in and see. Uh, a blemish is kind of like a like a bad mark. Um, you kind of get blemishes on your skin, right? You get kind of like little marks that, um, you know, impact the perfection of your own face. Uh, so it's it's not, there's nothing negative about this. Uh, no amount of their passing to be left. Like, I don't, I don't even know what that means. Like, so this is the benefit of maybe plugging the words in and sometimes they just don't make sense. And then sketch is the word we kind of thought was the more traditional meaning of trace, uh, but it doesn't make any sense. No sketch of their passing. They're not drawing what they're doing, right? So hopefully this just is obvious to you. Um, if not, then, I, you know, I don't know, like this is, this is about as easy as these get. So I don't want to rub it in, but like, remember, you're just trying to use the context. So put in the words into that spot and see which one sounds best. I hope one of them just jumps out because that's honestly the way I'm doing this.